Eiler will keep you posted on closings, delays. I mean, in the coming days, you never know, right? So these are instant. And that's the beauty of iAlert. So as soon as those closings or delays come in, you see them immediately. I'm not anticipating any of that to happen today because it is just rain as we're kicking off your Thursday. We told you about this yesterday that we would just have the wet early morning drive. We'll get into the rain snow mix a little bit later. And even right now it's scattered. So some of you are waking up to dry weather. This is going to vary from location to location. So we'll continue to track it for you. Even when roads are wet, we always talk about those slowdowns and look what's starting to happen. So if you've been with us since 4 a.m., we're already seeing temperatures slip to the west where we've got upper 30s now in Sandusky and Norwalk. The rest of you are still hanging on to those low and mid 40s. Not for long, lots of cold air. I mean, winter air, right? Single digits, teens, 20s, 30s, these are all current. And it's kind of uh, impressive when you take a look at that big picture across the region. So we're mixing it up for your Thursday. And by that, we're going to be talking about a mix of rain and snow here before long. It looks like by mid to late morning, we'll start to see that. And then into the afternoon, scattered snow showers. This system moves out and lake effect snow will start to become the story as we head into tonight in your Friday. So with lake effect, obviously you won't all be impacted, but many of you will. In the meantime, as we do take a look at the past few hours, we've had the rain showers light to moderate in intensity overnight and now into early this morning. So think about that extra time commuting. We're going to check in with Danielle here in just a sec. We'll go hour by hour. As promised on your National Design Mart forecast, this is the view at 8 a.m. It's still mostly rain, a chilly rain at that, but we're seeing that drop into the upper 30s further east at this point. We are seeing snow west at this point, so from Sandusky through Mansfield, and then we start to transition to that rain and snow throughout the rest of Northeast Ohio by 11 a.m. downtown, east suburbs, west suburbs, into Akron, Medina, and we'll continue into the afternoon. By 5 o'clock, we're seeing the back edge of all of that, and then as we get into tonight, we'll have a lull and let that little lake effect machine rev up and it will overnight and into tomorrow morning. Look at the view at 4 a.m. We've got lake effect snow bands. So where these bands do set up and persist, we could see some accumulation. We'll be watching that closely for you on your Friday. And of course, uh, you know, getting you to where you need to be safe and sound. We're only talking highs in the 30s tomorrow. Saturday still looking dry. It's a good one. It's just going to be a cool one with highs in the 40s. 50 Sunday and most of Sunday looks dry. We'll have a rain shower chance late. And then it's back to that change to snow and really cold next week with snow expected Monday, Tuesday, even into Wednesday.